Hey folks, welcome to another numeracy video. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to convert fractions into percentages. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so what we've got here is the first part is we've got 32 over 60, which is the fraction, and we want to convert this to a percentage. Now, unfortunately, some of these questions, you are going to need to use the calculator. Not all questions, you can actually do it um, without calculator. And certainly when I look at question C, that's something that you're going to need to use a calculator. So 32 out of 60, we want to convert this to percentage. So remember, anytime you want to convert a fraction into percentage, all you have to do is multiply by 100. Now, we are going to use the calculator for this particular question. So we're going to go into the calculator. We're going to put 32 out of 60 and we're going to multiply it with 100 and when we do this we are going to get roughly 53.33 percentage so 32 out of 60 as a percentage is going to be 53.33 and likewise we've got six um six over eight as a percentage so that means we're going to do six eights multiplied by 100 and once again, what we have to do is we actually have to um, do this on the calculator. But you can, some people are quite comfortable doing this without the calculator. But in this particular case, we just want to kind of push through. So we've got six eighths and we're going to multiply it by 100. And that's going to give us 75%. Now, folks, I know this, this particular question B was a nice number. So you kind of expect it to kind of fit in nicely. But most of the time with percentages, you are going to work with some really awkward numbers. So you need to be quite um, aware of rounding and so on. So let's have a look at 19 over 23 as a percentage. So what we're going to do is we're going to do 19 over 23 multiplied by 100. Now with that in mind, we've got 19 over 23 times 100. Now we just got to use the calculator for this. So we're going to go 19 out of 23 and we're going to multiply. Make sure the multiply is in the right space. Multiplied by 100. And as you can see, this is going to give us an answer of 82.61. So for this question C, we're going to write it as 82.61%. So just with the rounding, folks, just be aware that most of the time we tend to do two decimal places. But again, it depends on the context of the question. Uh, sometimes you might need a few more. So you just got to keep, um, keep an eye on that. But um, yeah, so just to kind of recap, all you got to do whenever you want to convert fraction into a percentage is you take the fraction and you multiply it by 100 and you should be good to go. All right, folks, that is basically it for this video. As always, don't forget to like this video, share this video and subscribe to keep up with the latest content. Now, there should be a couple of playlists popping up here and here. Great material for revision. And as always, thank you for watching.